freed Ukrainian filmmaker Oleg Sentsov and Crimean public activist Oleksandr Kolchenko will give the first press conference after their release as part of the prisoner swap between Ukraine and Russia. UATV's correspondent Natalia Chekatun is there now. Hello, Natalia. Has the press conference started yet? Hello, Carrie. No, we are still waiting for Oleg Sintsov and Alexander Kolchenko to be here at Kiev's Ukrainian house. And uh, journalists, as you can see, dozens of journalists and cameramen are now preparing for the interview for the press conference. And the press conference itself will last two hours. So it's like a huge opportunity, an amazing opportunity for journalists to ask all their questions. This is the first press conference of Oleg Sintsov and Alexander Kolchenko after their release, which took place on the 7th of September. As a reminder, they were among 35 Ukrainians who were released in exchange of 35 Russians and pro-Russian separatists. However, though these people were released, there are still uh, more Ukrainians who are now behind bars in Russia and the occupied parts of Donetsk. Uh, let's uh, listen now to Alexandra Matvichuk, a human rights activist, about the situation with the Ukrainian political prisoners. In our list, uh, we have at least 86 persons who are illegally detained in Russia and occupied Crimea and uh, with the status of political prisoners. And another group is more than uh, 200 of people who are detained illegally in occupied Donbas. It's uh, hostages and prisoners of the war. But the exact number, I must admit, we don't know. All these numbers only at the top of iceberg. As a reminder, Sentsov and Kolchenko spent over five years behind bars in Russia. They were accused of organizing terrorist attacks. Of course, these uh, charges are trumped up and they are largely believed to be politically motivated. Back to you, Carrie, and all the updates we'll bring you later. Thank you very much. We're looking forward to hearing more. That was Natalia Chekatun, our correspondent reporting live.